Hey there, I'm CG Plays, and this is Cassette Beasts, and we're here to find out what is this game, is it fun, and can we think of ways to make it better? Let's jump right in here. Empty file. Sure. Now rides this knight through the realm, into the wilderness of Wirral, few thereabouts that either God or other with good heart loved. Sir Gawain and the Green Knights. Unknown author, 14th century. Okay. Oh, what's this? We are going through some... Oh, who are you? Cass? Sure. Does defaults? Sure. Enter and apply safe changes. Go to the default. Seems fine. We'll zoom in here. We are Cass. And we are going through some kind of like interdimensional portal. Boxing with pepper cut, it said there. Harbor Town Beach, WC to move, jump, and dash. So this is kind of, uh, it looks, okay, this is not doing it justice here, but like the, the combat in this game actually looked pretty interesting. So stick around for that. Can I like interact with this? E? Where are you? Wood, obtained 100 wood, basic resource that can be exchanged for items and services. Not what I was expecting. So the game is basically, it's kind of like a Pokemon battler game, but like a, with a, a unique, unique twist. Instead of like summoning creatures, you, um, can I jump off this? Uh, you can, a little bit of lag there. Uh, you, like, you use cassette tapes and you become the creature and you can like combine your creatures, which seems cool. So I'm feeling, at the start, I'm feeling a little like directionless. Like, where do I go here? What is this? Hello? Oh, a battle. Okay, here we go. Here's the battle. Hey, stranger. Don't make any sudden moves. Audio balancing is not great so far. That's standard for these kind of games. Traffic crabs don't take kindly strangers, or anyone for that matter. All right. Here, take this. Uh, ah, yes. So this is like the cassette beasts thing. You know, you... you the old timey cassette tape and headphones, and you use this. Okay, quick question. What's your aesthetic? Uh, spooky or sweet? Sweet as in candies, or spooky as in, like... Ghosts and monsters will be spooky. Yeah, I can see that. In that case, take this. Uh, so, we, oh, so basically, oh, you're choosing your banshee. You're choosing your starting uh, thing. Scene one, it's 120 creatures recorded. Okay. The eerie moans of the wild banshee, but night have led, uh, may believe that they are restless undead spirits. This is untrue. They are very much alive. They just, uh, they just like to have a bit of a wine. Who doesn't? All right. Raise this monster's tape to five stars and unlock more information. Interesting. Have to have known. So as you, like, level up the tape more, uh, you don't love the monsters, love their tape. Interesting. All right, now just pop that in your cassette player, put on the headphones, and press play. <laughs> this might get a little weird, but follow my lead. All right, if you, if you insist, d your turn, don't be shy. I knew they, uh, this is how it works. I saw the trailer, but yeah, they transform into the monsters. Just breathe, he'll adjust in just a moment. We are now the monster by listening to the music. All right, let's give him heck. Well, they got a little, like, vocal thing in there. Oh, oh, I like this little UI for the combat here. Little cassette taper. Right that's neat. It like floats around his move. But Miles, that's very cool. Seems like a pretty well polished uh, game. We're level five, you're level one. Not sure what these are. I'm guessing the greens are hit points. Is this like my monster type? Probably. And that's your monster type. Trash for a cycle. Uh, I guess we'll fight. We choose what we want here. Uh, smack, power 30 hits one target. Or sheer luck. It's a passive ability. The user's evasion is passively raised in proportion. So the more I get hurt, the more I'm likely to dodge an attack. Right now we have one standard attack fight. We choose who to attack. Uh, you. And... Oh, I control the both of you. Okay, I thought you'd be controlled by her or something. Spit, dodge, call for help. Actually, 50% chance to summon a temporary ally. I mean, I just gotta see what that's all about. Uh, cast smack. There's the smack. And just one-shot it. Okay. Battle's been won. 49 XP. Neat. A uh, plastic, a basic recycled resource that can be exchanged for items and services. So the game also has like some kind of like uh, this is like a building mechanic to it. You handled yourself pretty well there. Uh, what's your name? I'm Kaylee. Uh, hi Kaylee. I'm ni nice to meet your acquaintance, Cass. Anyway, we should probably get you warmed up before you freeze to death in your pajamas. Wait, I wanted to keep exploring out there. All right, well fine. We'll come in here, I guess. It's got, it's got like a nice little aesthetic to it. It's very cutesy. Definitely heavily inspired by Pokemon, but they got some like a nice. Nice twist to it. This is also... I'm not controlling this. this it's a cutscene. The combat seems kind of cool. What do you think? Pretty quaint, right? Uh, what is this place? Welcome to Harbor Town. Okay. <laughs> Your new home. My new home? I already have a home. <laughs> I already have a home. <laughs> All right, yeah, sorry. I'm not very good at this part. I don't know how to best break the news. You're stuck here. Wait, what? We all are. My head's spinning. I don't feel so great. I don't feel so good. I passed out. Okay. Wonderful. Oh, what was that? Glitch, maybe? Ah, oh, wonderful. You're awake. Kaylee gave me a, quite a fright when she came knocking at my door. Dr. Pensby here. You had me scared for a moment, Cass. I don't think it's anything serious. Transforming for the first time is quite a shock to Psyche. Ah, so we literally are just transforming into these monsters. It's not an illusion. We just become them. 
Uh, anyway, Harbor Town happened to have a spare home available for you, so this is your place now. Where on Earth is this place? On Earth? On Earth? Kayla, you haven't told her? Sorry. Sorry, I should have, but she passed out. Not to info dump on you, but you're on an island called New Wirral. It's not strictly on Earth, at least that's what we think. Is there a way back home? I'm afraid not. Nope, I'm so sorry. Castaways have been trying to get back to their worlds for a century and none have succeeded. You. <laughs> but, but, but you'll be okay. There's a community at Harbor Town and we help each other out. It's not a bad life. And, and it's safe. Well, apart from monsters. Uh, like with a cassette player? Yeah. Yeah, actually, I'm going on a patrol soon. If you'd like to join me, meet me by the gate, the one just over the bridge we crossed to come into town. In the, way too much dialogue, man. <laughs> get, to the, get to the game. In the meantime, feel free to say hi to your new neighbors. So much talking. I'm pretty sure word has gotten around that there's a new lass in town. We also fetched some clothes for you, though they might be a bit out of fashion for your era, but it's all we have. My era? Sorry, sorry, I'm info dumping. I'll catch you soon, right? We can talk more then if you'd like. My clinic is nearby. If you need a checkup, feel free to visit. This all must be a lot to take in, but we all went through the same thing once. So much talking. So much talking. Uh, new quest, this is the world we live in. Oh, because we got like a little overall world map. Speak to Kaylee, the Harbor Town East entrance right there. Okay, uh, quest log with F, R to untrack. Okay, quest log. Here's the quest log. This one right here, all right? Neat. Wait, rumors. Ranger handbook, a handbook that Kaylee left for you. You can read this to review what you've learned about life on the island of New Wirral. Neat. All right, so uh, get off our bed. We can move around. Uh, we can change our clothes. Get out, get some better, get off our pajamas. How do I, you know, like, we're still in the sweater. Jacket. Okay, jacket two. Uh, vintage dress, vests. Jacket three. All right, whatever. Sure, seems, seems great. Um... Still feel like I'm wearing on my pajamas, but I can't be bothered to change the outfits. I'm just trying to like check out the game here, and uh, it wants us to go to the east. I want to check out the combat more. That's what I'm most interested in. Story lore, that's all fine and dandy and good, but like for me, it's all about the gameplay. What's what's where's the gameplay at? Show me the gameplay. Does it cutscene? No, I'm controlling it. I can, I can jump. I can like I can sprint. I don't know how I feel about like I don't. Oh, that's not a sprint. That's a that's a that's that's a dash. No, it is a, it is a sprint. It's a, it's hold to sprint. I don't know that I like the sprint being like. I want infinite sprint. Hey again, Cass. Are you feeling a little bit better? Because we walk slow in this game. Maybe speed of the walk cycle. You know, you held your own the last time we fought together. So well, I've been given an errand and need a helping hand. Do you think you'll be able to help me out? Errand? Sure. Uh, what's the errand? I'll explain in just a moment. Do you see that path there? Whoa. There was some kind of quake or monster activity last night. You can see the cracks in the ground. We're gonna check the path and make sure it's safe for crossing. All right, sounds good. Here, take the key to the gate. Uh, I like how I said, like, too much talking, then I click the dialogue thing that's gonna make them talk more, right? Alright, so you follow me around, and I press I, E. Remove from inventory Harbor Town gate key. Alright. Going through. Oh, I can, like, push them around. Oh, that's neat. I like that. Little little physics, although my, my teammates get in the way. That's, I like that. That's cool. Um, wants me to go over there. Can I go over this way first? Check things out? Uh... Right, uh, there's some basic I gotta show you first. Hope you're ready to turn into a monster again. Uh, I guess so. <laughs> You'll adjust in no time. It's like riding a bike. Except, you know, if the bike transformed into a moody floating sheep. <laughs> and also you're the bike. Alright, a little fight here. You see that creep with the boots? It's a spring heel. And it's going to get aggressive with you if you get any closer. So you're going to get closer, of course. Alright, so we like to pick fights around here. We're going in hot. What's up, dude? You want some of this? Let's go. Have at thee. I like the animation style. It's kind of nice. It looks like they transform automatically at the start. I'd probably swap out tapes in between battles to be fighting as different guys. Yeah, or I can just like switch here. Um, I don't think we have anything to switch. They all, they all looks like I have four on standby. So items, uh, consumables, blank tapes, miscellaneous. Probably don't need that right now. Don't want to flee. Zero percent chance to flee. It won't let you because the tutorial record. Um, I bet it's gonna teach me how to record, but maybe I can just like figure it out on my own. I have no blank tapes to record with, so we'll just fight. Tutorial action points. Ah, that's what those are. Pay attention to these orange squares. They are your action points, or AP for short. Most moves require you to spend AP. The amount of AP a move costs is shown next to its name. If you don't have enough AP for a move, you won't be able to use it this turn, okay? Each party gets two AP each turn, and an extra one if they land a type advantage attack. What's that? You can plan ahead and save AP for your most powerful attacks by using weaker, low AP moves. Neat. So this one costs no AP. This one costs three. So I need to save AP, so we'll use this one to build AP for the battering ram. So I guess I must have learned that between battles. I will smack you. Uh, oh, you can like smack yourself for science, can I? Uh, you can smack yourself. Good to know. I didn't think it would let me. <laughs> uh, so I can spit, I can dodge, or I can call for help. I want to call for help. You've got the AP for it. It only costs two. More chance to use a random move. Get it, give me a random. So 
they're gonna smack me. It took some damage. You take a bit of a beating, but your monster form can take it. The green bar represents your monster form's health, and the red is yours. Oh, interesting. So we have the green hit point bar, and then once that, that's all gone, then I have my own hit point bar? Okay. If a form loses all of its health and fight, its tape will break and need repairing. Gotcha. So we'll, like, smack back into human form. Not only that, but any extra damage to the attack that broke it will apply to your health, the red bar. Ooh. So there's, like, over trample, I guess. If both of us lose all our health, then we'll have to retreat back to Harbor Town. Got that? Yes. Right. right, let's crack on. So far, it seems pretty cool. The combat seems pretty neat. I like it. Smacked myself. Didn't do a lot of damage. I just want to see if I could. I failed. 50% chance for that to succeed and fail. Tragic. You get two AP back and survive each turn by the looks of things. Uh, we will battering ram power 70, actually 85%. Hits one target, lowers the target's accuracy. But I'm not sure how I feel about these things with like their terrible chance of actually succeeding, but part of the game. We'll see how we feel about it. Um, just seems like the odds of failing are pretty high. Accuracy down. Call for help. Hey, hey, we got a little puppy dog. Hey, what up, little dude? Can I click him? I want to see what he does. Um, can I like just... I want to fight. I, I want him to take a turn. Um, I can't do anything other than fight, though. What if I have you... Um, smack probably takes it out. I want to see a little puppy dog doing something. Fight. I'll have you raise uh, the, your evasion. I don't think the puppy dog's going to get a turn unless he's fast. Uh, Palm Bomb in flame. Hey, he did a thing. He attacked and burned. Burn characters take damage at the end of their turn. And they're gone. Little, cool. We can summon little puppy dog buddies. I like that. Get a level up. Cool. Level six. And plastic, pulp, wheat, uh, resource, mulch paper. So I, am I going to be able to, like crafting and building? That'd be cool. Um, obtain Sonic Boom. Ranged attacks. Oh, I, oh, I gained a ranged attack for um, uh, what's, what's her face. I don't know what you are. Okay, go along here. Nice work. What's this? Hmm, that elevator should be functioning. There'll be a switch around here to turn back on. So far, I'm loving this game. Seems pretty fun. Not sure if it'll appeal to my audience, because you all like either... I've got two types of viewers. Territorial viewers and uh, roguelike viewers. And this is like uh, more of like a creature collector viewer. I don't know, but uh, I'm having fun with it. Hmm, that elevator should be functioning. There'll be a switch around here to turn it back on. Ah, so we're... We're, we need, we're, we're stuck here. Where's, where's the switch? Uh, oh, hello. There's a secret passage back here you couldn't see so easily. Stand on that. And, uh, great. Let's head on up, shall we? I'll let you take the lead for any more fights, but don't worry. I'll be sticking with you from here on out. Cool. Uh, you're now my partner. Awesome. Welcome. I'm just clicking the button instead of pressing E. Sirenade. Did I get a new tape? Sirenades are particularly loud creatures and can amplify their own singing voices through their microphone tails and wings. Oh. They don't seem to have much awareness as to whether or not their singing is too loud for those around them. Ah. Alright, so let's get out of here. They're noisy. This is the world we live in. Follow Kaylee's directions. Gotcha. Alright, so run around and do it. Do what you tell me. Oh, that's kind of neat how you like a little change of perspective there. Oh wait, you're flying. You have wings? Okay, cool. You're flying around. school. cool. Let me in here. Gotta wait for this to... I thought I was trying to fix the path over here. I'm confused. You're not gonna let me go this way, are you? No, you are. I feel, I thought we were trying to like do something, like the camera panned, oh, the camera panned up there. But what's this? Is there anything here? Can I go in the water? Can I swim in this game? Nope, cannot swim. You just get like teleported back in there. All right. No simulate, wait, am I losing hit points? No, no penalty, but you can't go in the water. Good to know. Um, I don't like how the sprint, when you finish your sprint, it like stops you. I don't like that. So if you're going to give me a limited stamina bar, at the very least, don't have it like stun me after I use it up, right? Also, why limit my stamina bar at all? Why not just have, you know, infinite sprints? Guess we'll fight these guys. Limited stamina bar, unless there's a very good reason for it. Reason for it is not a thing people particularly love. Um, we'll go ahead and smack Karn of Viper 1. And you... Okay, I have no... I have no tapes to switch here, so... Yeah, nothing we can do there. So, our fighting options are kind of limited. Um, we will uh, spit as well, so the... Until I learn more uh, abilities or have more cards, whatever, our options here are kind of limited. I need to get, find a way to get your health up, because you're taking a beating. Well, that might be part of the tutorial, though me attacking myself probably wasn't super helpful. N now you're gone, and we'll give you the Battering Ram. So, if it hits, it's going to do more than double what that does. And lowers your accuracy, so you might miss. And you... Call for help, or Sonic Boom? Power 60 hits a whole team, could use that earlier, but it'll still help. I'll give it on you. Toxic stab. Oh, that's a big hit, and I'm poisoned. They take damage. Poison characters take damage at the end of their turn. All right, so that's the poison icon right there. We missed. Tragic. Sonic boom. 
Uh, good hit, you're out of here. I still take my poison damage even after the battle ends. I don't know how I feel about that. We t I, I guess it depends if we take poison overworld. We earn a new ability, sharpen, raise the user's melee attack. So we keep learning. We're learning new abilities very quickly for these guys. Okay. Getting more resources here. They'll be used somewhere, I'm sure. Need to find a way to heal. Can I go back down? Can I go back to hunt to heal? Do, ah, for he here's, yeah, healing here. Do you need a break cast? We can rest here if you like. Get some Dark Soul vibes from like campfire healing, right? I guess that's in a lot of games, actually. These bonfire pits mark areas you're safe to set up camp. I just think of, anytime I think of a bonfire healing you, I think of uh, Dark Souls. It, not that I play that game much. It gives you a chance, I just watch people play it. It gives you a chance to repair your tapes and heal up. Cool. Oh, I don't want to fight this guy, I want to heal up. Do I click it? I click it. Campfire, camp here, yes. And what do we have? Uh, oh, it costs resources to do it, so four wood. So this is what the resources for, for healing stuff. So let's, let's rest. Remove inventory, four wood, and... I used to go camping a lot, a bit of a story here, I used to go camping a lot when I was a kid. Ireland has a bunch of great places to camp out, so you're from Ireland. My da would drive the two of us to the countryside and we stargaze together. Do people in Ireland say da? Uh, so dad, camping with you makes me nostalgic for that time. Okay. That seems like a really well put, uh, put together little game. I think there's uh, a lot of potential here. Alright, so we've already rested, so I guess we're fully healed party. Um, yep, we're all, we seem to be all topped up. Are my, are my, are my tapes topped up? Check, uh, check tape. And yeah, you're, you're all healed. Oh, what's this? Tutorial stickers and moves. The moves you have access to when using a tape in battle are determined by what stickers are attached to the tape. Oh, like the sticker right there. You can gain new moves to a tape by applying stickers from your inventory. Moves you don't want can be peeled as stickers and put in your inventory. Oh, that's very cool. I like that. Stickers can be used as many times as you want, but can only be applied to a single tape at a time. Stickers can be obtained in a few ways, by filling tapes experience point bars from chests or caches you find from certain merchants in Harbor Town. So I can like, uh, uh, you're my favorites. Okay, use item view beast cherry. Edit stickers. So edit stickers basically just cha swapping out moves. So I have empty slots, apply sticker. I have nothing available. So um, yeah, right click to cancel out there. I can remove, I, can, I think for now, it's, I think it's fine. I don't really have any like spare stickers. Check tape, uh, empty slots. I mean, there's no, there's no spare sticker, so no point, but good to know that you knew that. That's pretty cool. Tape storage. I have no spare tapes, okay. Inventory, uh, nothing here except for like some resources that will be used, get used for various things. I guess we just exit we're all healed up. All right, man, I'm, I'm, I'm into this, man. I'm into this game. Where'd this guy go? Despawned? All right, whatever. We'll keep moving along here. Maybe, oh, maybe it's because maybe it's nighttime. I am noticing some weird lag spikes here and there. Not really sure what's causing those. Could be a, like my computer for all I know. Um, or it could be like things loading. There'll be more monsters about, but we can take them. All right, this guy's chilling. He's not a monster, he's just hanging out. I haven't seen you around before. Let me guess, you washed up pretty recently, didn't you? Oh, is that a cassette player you're holding? Here, take these. Oh, you're so nice. Rewind, uh, fully restores the hit points of an, of one type. Uh, use up a, a turn when using combat. So it's like a, it's like, a, like an elixir. Uh, it's like full heal. All right, cool. I see you down there, monster. I will go to war with you. I don't, I, I re, oh, what's that? Uh, come on, it's this way. Oh, I, I'm going too far away, the wrong direction. They want me... Uh, so they don't want me going up here? Where, where do I'm going? So I, I really don't like that when you sprint, you stop after you full use up your sprint meter. I guess, like, don't use it all the way? But I, I, uh, if the developer happens to see this video, your your sprint mechanic, it needs, a, it needs a redesign. It needs to be looked at again. It's not, it's not good enough, in my opinion. But aside from that, no real... No real gripes so far, apart from the game, aside from the sprint mechanic being stinky. Sharpen and raise the user's melee attack. How much? How much, though? Uh, only for themselves. Call for help. I mean, I'll try for a call for help if we get lucky. Raise arms. I guess you're, yep, range attack up. Jump scare. You are, ooh, 17 damage and you've flinched. What does that mean? A character that flinches skips its next turn. Ooh, stinky, 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 stinky. We sharpen, so we got up by three. How much stronger? So our power was 30 on our basic attack. Now it still says power 30, so I'm not sure how much that three difference it makes. We'll do a battering ram, hopefully get lucky. Let's get you since you can make us skip our turns. And you already skipped, your your turn already got skipped. Um, I guess we'll just have you spit in case the one person's hits not to take them out. Ow, 21 damage. Jump scare, enough with the making me skip my turns, dude. Enough of that, am I gonna lose my attack? No, I need this guy going, 24 is not a lot. Try this again, uh, let's give you uh, I'll give you a, a battering ram to really seal the deal. I've had enough of your attitude. Let's get it. If you're gonna keep making me some of my turns, having a third 
This character here is going to help. Holy crap, 50 damage and poison? Peekaboo, at least it didn't make my skip my turn. Accuracy down, do we miss? Probably. Oh my god, this spring wheel guy is awful. Spring heal. Haha, uh -huh, I've got a, a buddy too. The poison's brutal. I can use the item if need be. Please, uh, this has better accuracy. We'll use this, even though it's not going to be as strong. Um, we'll have you... Uh, Sonic Boom. Yeah, that'd be that'd be a good one. Spits, 22 damage, I'll take it. Little guy helping. Oh, take some hits here. Tough fight for us, tough fight. I can go back and heal at the campfire for this, because we're going to need to... Would you stop? Okay, he didn't make me miss my turn. That's fine. 35 on you, okay. So, I'm not sure the melee up thing did that much extra to help us do damage. Was it really worth? I don't know. Uh, level up, okay. Got some little goods there. Fantastic. I'm going to go back and heal. I'm going to go heal. Avoid this, these guys here. And heal with this. Camp here. Do a quick and rest real quick. Thank you. Remove inventory from... Uh, yep, lovely. The two of you have fun throwing twigs into the campfire. Great. It takes a while. It does take a while to get the heal going. Kind of wish I was a little bit quicker. It's not so bad, though. I want, like, a quick heal option. I want a, I, I want a quick heal option where you can just, like, show up here. If there's no story to be had, you can just, like... Um, you know, press F to, you know, spend four wood to insta-heal. Instead of having to go through, like, loading through all those screens, whatever. I think that'd be nice. Did we, like, like skip to the night? And am I, was I supposed to be doing this at night? Or whatever, I don't know. Um, maybe sleeping twice wasn't part of, like, the dev's plan for stuff. Come on, it's this way. Where am I going? Across here? Up this way? Okay. All right, then. Uh, so you want me to go... Uh, you want me to go across here is where you want. All right just tutorial things. What's happening? Oh, I ran on my stun. I was looking at the cameras, uh, the recording things, see how long they're recording for. I don't want the video to be too long. I, I really, really, really don't like that when I s sprint all the way, it just stops me. Don't like that at all. Do you see that monster? There, there must be a way to get over to come over here, okay? Developer, please, if you see this video, this right here, unacceptable. 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 Just stopping for two seconds there. Um... Go ahead and switch the lever over here. I'll, that, and that'll be the last I complain about it. Sorry for those of you who I'm triggering by complaining too much about that. Uh, look, there's constructive criticism and there's complaining, and I've been, I've been, I've been okay. dancing into the ra the realm of complaining. I'm sorry. I need to keep it on constructive criticism and then move on. Okay, take these. Um, although repeating helps the developer to be more likely to like notice, remember it records. Uh, if they see this video, records monster forms the normal efficiency rate. Hey, we got we got tapes to like grab forms now. There's something about the monsters on the new, on new world. When weakened, their essence can be, well, recorded to cassette tapes. We don't entirely know how it works, but it does, and that's good enough for us. Is he, like, dancing in circles? What's going on? I'm going to steal your... your uh, so you weaken them and grab them. So let's uh, record. Yeah, click it. Um, sure. Basic tape. Uh, use use on. Uh, are they weak enough by default? I feel like I'm supposed to weaken you before I try to record, but want me to record first. I'll spit on you. Yeah. Basic tape. Oh, oh I, oh, I leave my form. 28% chance. And we failed because you're not weak enough. But if I soften you up a little bit, wait, he tried to. Did they try it again? Interesting. Wait, wait, hundred percent chance, and they they're speeding up. What's happening here? Oh, it worked. Okay, that was weird. Like they, she tried, failed. The other person attacked, and they tried again. Didn't think they get to try it twice. Okay, that's kind of neat. Domino. Domino see themselves as defenders of peace and spend their days patrolling the skies of woodland areas. The only thing that can tr distract them from their noble duties are bright lights such as lamps. Uh huh. Because they're moths. They're moths. Uh, recording tapes tutorial. Whether a recording succeeds or not is down to chance. However, several factors affect the probability of success. How much health the monster has, its level and rarity, how much damage you dealt it while recording, and how much damage the person recording it took. So, lower its health, the rarity, our hit points, and how much damage we got. Okay, got it. Um, buffing your attacks or debuffing the target's defenses can be an effective way to increase the damage you deal a target and improve the odds in your favor. Uh, as long as the monster is being recorded, it cannot flee or be defeated. Oh, I think when you tell them to record, they just keep trying to record it like over and over and over again throughout the combat, maybe. I don't know. You cannot flee or be defeated, so you don't have to worry about knocking out. Oh, I like that. I like that. I really like that. One of the things about Pokemon I didn't love is that like you're trying to capture them by like, oh, you knocked them out. With this game, there is no... You can't knock them out. They can't run them away, so you tell this person to record. This person just keeps on wailing on them, and eventually you should get them, unless you, like, lose the fight. I like that. That seems like an improvement upon 
the standard Pokemon design. Well, I mean, I'm not really up to date on most of the Pokemon games. It's been a while, so maybe this has kind of become like normal Pokemon things for all I know, but now try switching to the tape you just recorded. Also, he's still here, so we're not, we're not capturing him. We're like grabbing a copy of him. Okay. We didn't actually beat you. I just got a copy of you. All right, so you. Why does it have three stars and you only have two stars? Well, I got, is that is that two stars with the favorite next? I think that's two stars with the favorite next to it, not three stars with the one star being filled with the heart. Uh, I, don't, I want to click you. Oh, it still shows up down here. I thought it was because of the connect you tape. Um, here, there's a thought. There's a thought. Um, when I click here, I feel like this UI should appear over here because my first impression when I clicked this was that I misclicked and actually clicked yours, but it's actually. I mean, it's, it's you can figure it out, but I feel like, you know, just for, it, it's fine, it's fine, whatever. It'd be better if it appeared next to the one you click, but I think it's fine. People have figured it out. Um, don't want to nitpick too much here. Uh, what do you want to do here? I want to, I don't want to do that. I want to, I want to click this, Dominoth, and uh, transform. And what, that you'll do that. Great. And sorry, I'm sorry, I'm taking so long. I'm my brain doesn't always work. Uh, uh, is you know, moving on. Aha! That's how you get yourself new monster forms. However, if a monster takes too much damage, it'll flee, so you won't be able to record it. You with me so far? Right. Now, let's finish this bug off. Alright. Ooh, a little, little uh, throwing attack there, and big hit on you. The question is, I mean, I'm not going to switch, but like, does your, does your, does your hit points recover when you put them away? Probably not. Oh, there's a hit point bar on the tape itself, I see. So if I had taken some hits with Banshee here, their hit point would be like down. Okay, so this is your hit point on the tape. You can check to see if they're full or not. Just by glancing the menu. Okay, I'm into it, I'm into it, I'm into it. Seems well done. We'll fight. What do you have? Smack, power 30, same as the other ones. Uh, sprint, raise the user speed. So I think my Banshee might actually be better than this thing, but um, that's fine. You know, the first thing you get is not going to be better than the starter, right? Just gotta like do some learning here. Ow, it hurts. It's also good to have things to swap to if you get low in hit points, you know, they're ways away from a campfire or whatever. Got him. Victory, the battle was won. All right. And this little blue bar right there was my hit points. Zephyr equipped. Um, I Oh, we learned a new attack. Ranged attack, 60. Ooh, good power. That's pretty good, actually. That's actually pretty good. Maybe it is better. That blue line right there, right, it keeps disappearing. I want to show it. Ooh, a little floaty. What's this? Uh, uh, was this meant to happen? Some monster forms give us extra abilities when we record them, beyond just being able to take their shapes. Cool. So we can get abilities in this game. I'm, I'm into it. Don't panic. So we have wings now. And that's why she had wings, because she had the Sonic thing. Mothwing Glide, you can hold space to glide across long distances. This consumes your stamina. Ah, uh, and now the stamina meter begins to make more sense to me. Okay. I see. So to get a little bit further. Um, Sorry. Sorry, I uh, should have probably have warned you, but I thought it might be a little easier to show you. We can use this to glide. You can use this glide to get across that gap right there. All right. Now, this is the world we live in. Accompany Kaylee to the broken pathway. Cool. Can I, I want to get across there. I don't think it's going to let me, but. So, was it hold space? Yeah, it was hold space. Ooh, I want this chest, though. Oh, there's a guy there. What's in the chest, though? Uh, sprint. Raises the user's speed. Oh, can I use this, like, is this, oh, this is like a sticker, or is this like something that make me sprint faster in the overall? It's probably a sticker for, like, characters, right? Um, inventory? No. Uh, party. Yeah, so this little blue, I, I tried to point out, this little blue line right here is the XP. So I need this much more XP until the next uh, level up. I want to give you, can, uh, who wants a sticker? Uh, check tape. You already have sprint, so maybe not for you. Um, give, uh, check tape. I could give you Sprint. I don't, don't know that I would use it, but I guess I don't want to attack. Yes, yeah, so it is a sticker. Apply the sticker. Hey, we got a sticker. Cool. So we applied stickers. I like that. That's neat. What, is all, what else is in here? Map is this thing right here. Shows all your stuff. You can hover over it for more details. It'll tell you like points of interest. That's the campfire. That's the town. Something over there. Quest log is this. We complete the first few steps of it. We're still working on it. Um, Beastie area shows us information about all these guys. Okay. Uh, settings, uh, quest log. All right, thanks enough. And I should probably talk to you, right? E. Have you seen these red caches about? Us rangers leave supplies them for each other when traversing the island. In fact, I was just about to play something in this one. Why don't you take it instead? Uh, Respool fixes and rewinds a broken tape. Uses up a turn music combat. Ah, so this is this is like a it's like a revive or like a phoenix down. If you're familiar with those, like if your character's knocked out, you can use that to like bring them back in. I saw that moth thing up. I, I see you up there, Mothman. Don't think I don't see you. 
Well, they're supposed to be like the good guys. They're like defenders of peace. Why are we fighting them? I don't know. Uh, why can't I, uh... I'm like holding space to glide. I guess, do I need... I, I, gotta, be, I gotta be like high enough. Yeah, you gotta be like falling off something to glide. Gotcha. I could fight you, but I don't feel like I probably need to. I'm gonna glide across this. Yeet. There we go. And still don't, still don't feel like the getting stunned after um, gliding is necessary. Uh, gliding or sprinting is necessary. What is this? Are we supposed to be like gliding around to other places? Can I like, let's get down over there? Nope. I like the arrow showing you where you're actually at. That's kind of neat. What am I trying to do here? Uh, let's go down here. Press the lever right. The lever. Uh, we've made the lever turned on some wind from down below. So is that making us happy, boys? Are we pleased? <laughs> oh, oh, you can magically fly up. That seems unfair. All right, so I guess that's that's I guess that's like the path back because we probably can't get back from that way, right? But we go around this way over here. See what we can find. Just go around the corner. What are you doing? We've got an earthquake going on here. What's going on? If this is because of monster activity, we better stay sharp. Let's go. So are you, are, even even you're enough. You're okay. The AI and you could be a bit better. <laughs> Walk around. Don't try to fly over that, right? Um, do I need to fight you? You'll pass. Keep looking at things. Checking things out. Okay, you felt that one, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I did. Maybe I should have leveled up a little bit. Oh, what's this? New monster? It's a person? Destroyed the ground quite a lot. No, oh, it's like a what? dungeon? What is that? Oh, well, even you're shocked by it. Well, was this always here? This isn't normal? I've never seen anything like this before. Has this always been buried here? Uh, quest update. This is where we live in. Investigate the strange structure. You got it. Yeah, you know, I'll, 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 a quick fight with the crab here for a level. Wait, no, what about my, what about my hit points? Oh, dandelion, okay. All right, um, we'll, we'll fight here and give you, um, I'm not sure if sharpening's worth it, maybe in long fights. Give a smack on the traffic crab. And I want you to, um, you can't sonic boom yet. If I save, I could, sonic boom is probably more useful than call for help. I'm gonna, I'm gonna like d raise my evasion, maybe, and uh, you know, be more likely to dodge if you try to attack me. Why'd you take damage over time? Uh, extra 13 there. Plastic wall, that's kind of cool. Well, oh, that's a cool game mechanic. Shields, the, like Pokemon, but they can have someone shields themselves. That's cool. Uh, tutorial plastic wall. Walls absorb a certain number of incoming hits. Type advantage attacks immediately break walls. It's like Legos. And you're gonna smack me. My stand, that's not so bad. You don't hit too hard. Unless you use a, 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 a nasty ability. So what they, uh, what they, I, did, I literally, did it say they blocked two attacks, is what it said? I don't know. Uh, we will fight. Uh, we will... Uh, bat we'll go for the guy who's not shielding up then. You shall sonic boom the two of them. Beautiful. How much? Missed. Ah, oh, man, I, this... Imp like, 85% is like brutally low accuracy, I feel like. Ear type plants... Uh, ear type attacks can uproot plant type targets. Disconnecting them from the source of their nutrients, the ground. So this is a plant type, dandelion. So that's a plant type icon. It was a rooted to the ground, but I just uprooted it with that air attack. Okay. Characters with AP drain gain one fewer AP each round. So I gave it AP drain by taking it away from the ground. Okay. Less AP for you, but you're already like kind of near max. 14 damage is not so bad. You did defend, melee defense up. These guys are like really defensive. I probably shouldn't have been skipping fights because like I'm getting tutorials in these fights. Um... I'll try the battering ram on you, see if we can smash that defense. Let's go ahead and get another uh, sonic boom here. Uh, you, so you have like one, th yeah, it's, it blocked two hits where it took out one. The sonic boom here will take this other, oh, we took him out. All right, we'll waste the sonic boom, but there's your little plastic shield gone. All right, learning all kinds of things about this game. Like the more I play it, the more neat it gets. Uh, we have two energy left, let's give you a little smacky-dappy-doo. And you can give him uh, a little spit, maybe that's enough to take him out. If we're lucky, we land our hits. They just spit on them. Gross. Icky. Victory battles one. I like how their whole thing is like they have a microphone, they're all about with singing or whatever, and like but one of their one of their attacks is just spitting. You think of their attacks would be singing or yelling. No, they're spit on them. So we got uh we got a lot of stuff here. Provoke for you, bite for you. Got a... Uh, wait, I earned I, this guy leveled up too? I'm guessing the ones so you I'm guessing the ones that are in your inventory also uh level up as well? I'm guessing. Maybe? How else would we have learned it? So, okay, uh, good to know. It's going here. So even if they're not in the battle, they can still level up. Is this a train station? It should be okay to look around, right? Weird, why is there a train station in here? All right, we'll go looking around here. 
And what is this? What is, what is, what is this right here? Can I interact with it? Nope. Alright, guess we'll do little baby mini runs so we don't completely run out of stamina like, and stun ourselves. This place smells like burning metal. I can't explain it. What does burning metal smell like? You okay? What does burning metal smell like? I got a little turnstile that's covered in blood. Spooky. I think over the left. Uh huh. Secrets. Open up. What you got for me? Uh, rapid fire. Ooh. It costs five. But it hits three times for 90 total. Hits one target multiple times. The priority over, over other moves. What, what do you mean? Like, as in, like, I'll go first? Or, like, what do you mean priority over, the, over, over moves? Let's, let's equip that. Uh, let's go into our party. And let's give, give it to you. Uh, check tape. What's well, not doing much for us? Uh, we can swap out the sprint. We got bite. Wait, no, bite has 80 power. That's just better, right? And it heals us. Yeah, we'll we'll stick with that. We'll give it to we'll give it to uh. I mean, you've got we'll give it to, give it to Dominoth actually. Yeah, quickly. Uh, check tape, and we'll give you a ply sticker. Yeah, rapid fire. Oh, it's only it's not compatible with you. Who is it compatible with? Um, empty slot ply sticker. Uh, it works for you, okay? Or I could recycle it for some goodies. All right, it's very quiet in the menu. Um, go down here. Maybe my my I guess maybe my speakers are down low. I don't know. I've, I on the recording is showing this volume coming in. I just can't hear anything. My speakers are too quiet. Cass, can you feel something in the air? Um, a boss fight? Maybe. In this uh, demo. Ooh, yeah. cutscene. Okay, okay. Some invisible. Oh, some invisible creature. Nope, not invisible. It's missing arms. Ooh, interesting. I like it. Good cutscene. Cool looking boss. Very neat. Is that you, Mordred? Come closer, child, so I may see you one last time. Do I click through advance? I do. This is... This is... Your mother? The long conflict has drawn to an end. I am afraid he has defeated me truly this time. Cass, I think this is an archangel. This is cool. We need to leave. Now. This isn't like the other monsters. We are not safe here. Who are you? What happened to you? No. No. No, you are not my kin. You come for me once again. Sword in hand? We have no swords. We are just oh, monsters. No. Oh no. Uh oh. We didn't listen. Should have ran away. Archangel Morgante. Broken spirit. This is cool. Let's say no, take no further steps. What does it say down there? Morgante. Very low in hit points. Guess it's like a, an already damaged spirit. So the only... Yeah, Archangels, I guess they're like really tough creatures. Level 100, but this one happens to be already weakened for whatever reason. Maybe that dude that like flew away earlier was fighting and softened up, but like panicked and ran just before the, the deed was done. Go ahead and fight. And let's give you... Um, give myself sprint for whatever reason. I don't know. It'll help me dodge better. Uh, provoke. Prevents opponent from directly targeting the allies. So I so like to taunt. Um, I'm just going to dodge and work on like survivability here. I'm not sure what sprint does. Uh, I, I, didn't, I didn't read the text there. Discord. Probably said speed up. Discord and thrash. Missed. Lucky. Maybe the speed helped. And we can do bites for 80 and heal ourselves a little bit. Yeah, bite Morgante. And you, what do we want you to do? Sonic Boom hits for 60. That hits for 30. Um, I could call for help. Seems like a good idea for a boss fight. A little bite on you. Okay. Seems to only heal for one. Barely did any hit points. Failed. Unlucky. Discord and Thrash. Maybe this is like a scripted boss fight that we're supposed to lose. Feels like it. Tutorial Archangels. That was a lot of damage. Unlike other monsters that spend AP to use moves, Archangel Archangels accumulate all their AP until it reaches 10. Once an Archangel reaches 10 AP, it unleashes all that power at once in its unique angelic attack. To survive, use your moves for teaching to either set up a solid defense in preparation or defeat the Archangel before it gets enough AP. So it's like a timed fight, effectively, where like I, if you, by attack 10, you either gonna have tons of defense or beat it by then. Okay. Um, I guess it's like every normal fight, you know, win for the, the hitch too hard. We need to, I should use items here. Um, item, uh, or, yeah, rewind to fully, use on, uh, uh, band sheep to rewind the tape back to when it had full health. Fantastic. You, I really need you to, uh, succeed this call for help. Would be great. There we go. Okay, we got a little dude in here. Discord and Thrash, don't you one tap my little dude. Missed. I'm not gonna die here. Not like this. Do you hear me, Cass? This isn't the end for us. It can't be. All right, wait, what's happening? I refuse. What? What's, what's, what's happening? Are we, are we like, 
Oh, this is the final. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mentioned it earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to fight this thing and we're going to do it together. Cass and Kaylee's hearts act as one. That's right. Fusion. Fusion. Banade. That's right. I forgot. Fusion. Yeah, I mentioned it earlier at the start of the video. I think there's fusion in this game. Uh, when your goals are aligned with those of your companion, you can fuse to become a singular, more powerful beast. The closer you are to companion. So there's going to be some kind of like emotional, like, uh, like how, like friendship meter kind of thing. The closer you are to companion, the more powerful you are as fusion. Keep an eye on your fusion meter, though. You can only fuse when this is full, so there's a fusion meter. Uh, as a fusion, you gain 4 AP each turn instead of 2, which makes sense because 2 of you, allowing you to use, uh, to make use of your more powerful moves sooner. You also have access to all the moves of both tapes combined, and your stats are added together. That's awesome! That's awesome, okay. It was like, we're an amped up version of ourselves. What do we want here? Sc uh, mouse wheel to scroll down. Rapid fire. So three hits for, I mean, that takes five, but we get four per turn. That's probably, my, like, that does the most damage of anything right now, so rapid fire. Give them to, give them to you. Cast slash Kaylee, rapid fire. I'm only hit it for one hit point each, so that's kind of interesting. So, I guess multiple attacks is good. Elemental wall. Hey, traffic crab. It's got three hits on it, so I can block three hits with, with that traffic wall. Ooh, so it looks like, oh, he was actually, they're aiming at that. That's, I know you miss a lot. Um, I feel like Rapid Fire is great because you only take one, like every time I hit you, I only hit you for one. So multi-attacks seem good. You're at max stuff there. Undertow, I don't know what Undertow just did. Morgana, take Code Morgana, and you're breaking this. Luckily, oh, 58 damage, you you survived. You took out my shield. Shield's helping us, so first Archangel is going to be like a, oh, it's like a week into one. More Rapid Fire. Keep working on you. I think this first Archangel is, Archangel is meant to be like an easy one that was like near death. Um, just to kind of teach you all about the Archangel Undertow. Hey, he just did... Did my... Did my traffic crab just do 28 damage to me and run away? Excuse you? Excuse you? Excuse me? I don't think that's okay. Who's this? New guy. I guess, I guess you're... Oh, ah, 230 damage! <laughs> okay. All right. Better use that to keep ourselves alive. Oof. Wait, I gotta... Oh, wait, I'm both? Is one gonna heal? Okay, just do either or. Heals them both up. Okay. You would think if you go to the main menu, there'd be like one merge tape, but I guess not. Water wall, protecting yourself. All right. Neat. Discord and Thrash. Mist. Okay. We will fight. We will give you the rapid fire, because it seems to be doing great things for us. I feel like there's a missed opportunity for your fusion when you have max AP. I think we, we beat him. A uh, Foss to your spit. Only one damage because crit because you have like high defense. I feel like there's a missed opportunity for fusions when you have max AP to have like a special ability that's unique to that particular fusion. Maybe that's something you can unlock. Maybe that maybe that's already in the game and it's something you unlock later on. But I do like for science. I want to know if I can. Can I call for more than one? Nah, we'll just go ahead and keep fighting him. I feel like that'd be really cool, like, you know, when they get max AP, they get a special attack. If I get max AP, I want a special attack, right? That'd be pretty cool, at least for the fusions. I guess they just run away after a certain amount of time, that's what they do. Code Morgana, holy crap. I think this, this battle is scripted that I have just enough hit points at max to survive it. We'll be using this, thank you. Unless it's attack that's percentage based and I could keep my hit points low for all I know, I don't know. Discord and Thresh, I need to take you out soon, you are doing... Uh, things to us. Uh, we will rapid fire, get some value out of this. Try and win this battle here. You're pretty low on hit points. Surely we win this soon. Sure. There we go. Job done. All right. Victory. The battle is won. Got uh, 250 XP points. We, it, all right. Wait, did the sh I feel like I saw two X X XP marks going there. One on the tape and someone on us as well. We have our own level separate of the tapes. Maybe. Up grape. Curious bunch of upside down grapes that it grows from seeds planted on backwards day. Eh? Eating a bunch instantly upgrades a tape by one star. Ooh, so tapes have stars, whatever that means. Fused material, it smells strongly of rotten eggs, but rangers seem to regard it as valuable. Interesting. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, wait, I have three stars in my tape now. Maybe the stars in the tape is the tape's level? I don't know. How did we... I don't know. How did we fuse? Good question. Your stamina increased by 20%. You can now glide for three seconds. Okay, so the stamina improves over time. I'm into it. Okay, I'm, in, I'm into it. So, maybe there's more to the stamina thing that I was talking about. I still don't like the stun at the end of the stamina, unless that's something we can, like, remove later on in the game by leveling up. And then, and then, then it's fine. 
if we the whole stun if you're done sprinting thing. Enough, my time is drawing to an end. Why have you come to this wretched place? Um, I want to go home. I see. There is a way. There are none who know the path but I. It's a shame we almost took you out. I require a vessel, and you require a guide. Rebuild my strength, and in turn, I shall lead you from this land. Okay, so you're the, like uh, the the overall arcing goal here. Uh, vessel. Very well. Very well. Hear my song. Wait, what? Oh, oh, we're the oh, we're getting possessed by that archangel's dying spirit. Okay, interesting. If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. Okay. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the path most long. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. Interesting. So we gotta like make it louder, hear it better. Caster UK, what happened? You blinked out for a second there. We should get out of here. Okay. Sounds good. Oh, we're back. We are back. A lot happened to that train station. I guess we should probably talk about it. Uh, about us, uh, about, about the Archangel. Archangels. Archangels. Supposedly, when the first unlucky sods washed up on the shores of New Weirl, they thought the monsters here were angels. Interesting. And, and some of them wrote of other entities too, greater than the others. Creatures that look and feel wrong. Logically, they call these other creatures archangels, the highest ranking among the order of angels. Of course, when people learned they could fight and defeat the regular monsters, they lost their angelic allure. Well. They've had a bunch of names over the years. Angels, demons, devils, ghouls. We just call them monsters now. It's a good catch-all term. <sighs> Those other creatures, though, like the one we fought, they're still... Who would see a crab with, like, a little like a little cone on its head and think, That's an angel! <laughs> really? Those other creatures, though, like the one we fought, they're still archangels to us. You think it's kind of like an animal with a helmet on. We don't know what they are. No one's really seen one for a long time. Looking at that thing we fought, it's hard to explain. Well, where'd they all go? Do we beat them all? If uh, where all the archangels disappeared to, it felt like I wasn't viewing it correctly. Like I, uh, it works. It felt like I wasn't viewing it correctly. Like trying to watch a movie through binoculars or something. Enunciate, CG. Oh, sorry. I'm making some assumptions there. We're all from different worlds, after all. <laughs> you might not know what movies are. Uh, what are movies? Just kidding. Uh, yeah, be be jokester. Few. Okay. Grand. I've been in New World for three years, and I've still not completely learned to adjust my cultural references when I talk to new folks. But it's fusing. Oh, yeah, that. Fusion is a rare phenomenon known by the rangers. Uh, there are fused monsters in the wild, and supposedly the leader of the rangers can do it too. In the right circumstances, two people in monster form are able to unite and form one powerful being. I guess the right circumstances include nearly being killed by an angel, archangel. It felt strange. In that moment, I was sharing a body with you, and the thing we became was both us and not us at the same time. I, I've never fused anyone before. I certainly wasn't expecting to fuse with someone I barely know. It just kind of happened in the heat of the moment, right? Sorry. Sorry, talking about it is a little bit awkward. Uh, it helped us defeat the Archangel. Yeah. yeah, I guess you're right. Now that we've done it, I have this weird feeling inside me. This game is like an illusion of choice where either dialogue you picked is kind of like very similar. I have this weird feeling inside me, like a door has been opened that I didn't even know it was there before. That's pretty standard for a lot of games, though. I feel like I'd be able to fuse you again if you ever needed to. So it's an ongoing mechanic, uh, as expected. So let me get this straight. That Archangel, Morgant Morgante, her memory is inside you now, and she knows a way to leave New World. If there's even a chance that this can lead uh, to a way off this island and return people to their homes and their families, we owe it to everyone a new world to find out. You and, I. you and I, us together forever. Forget the adults. What do you say? Are we in this together? Uh, sure, let's do it. Uh, a relationship level one. Fusion is now available in regular battles when partnered with Kaylee. So why would you? So, question. Why would you just not like be always fused? Like, why would you not choose to always be fused? Fusions you form with Kaylee now have plus five percent added strength. Maybe sometimes, I guess because you only get like one attack per turn as opposed to like two, right? Like I could, like with the fusion, I can highlight you're fused, you attack that one guy, turn over. But if I have the two of you split, you can attack this guy, and then you can attack that guy. So maybe it's not always better to be fused. You only want to fuse against one on one fights, right? Building relationships, or maybe it like costs resources, I don't know. Building relationships with friends is really important. The strength of relationship directly affects how strong you are in fusion. It probably, just, it probably doesn't cost resources, but whatever. Some downside or some limitation to it. Otherwise, people just do it constantly, right? Maybe you want to do it constantly. You can get closer to someone by completing, the, by completing their quest and by battling alongside them. When the time is right, you can take a break at a campfire uh, or at the cafe to level up your, relation, your relationship. Sorry, I can't talk. If an archangel gave you that vision, then you need to find another one, and you need to be strong enough to stand against it when you do. Uh, quest complete. This is where we live in. Fantastic. All right. New quest, Land of Confusion. Locate archangels to complete Morgante's song, then follow the clues it contains to find your way home. Okay. Alright, 
The Rangers have a training program that will help you become strong enough. Let's begin by getting you a meeting with the Ranger leader. She'll be at the outpost in the park right about now. New quest, take me on. Head to the outpost in the park to sign up to the Rangers. All right. And, uh, just exit out of there, I guess. That was like a, like, in-town resting point there. But uh, I think that's a good a, a good spot to wrap it up. We've got the lore, we've got the story, we got um you know the, all, most of the core game mechanics I think. And can I like, jump in here? I can't. Can I like can I like do the jumpy floaty thing in here? No. Oh, we can. Cool. But uh, honestly, a lot of potential. Thing is pretty neat. If this video does really well and lots of views, lots of watch time, and you guys just want to see me play more, I can do a series on it. Um, if not, there will have a, be a little little one off here. Um, but yeah, I like it. I, I think this uh could be a fun little game. Uh. But, uh, yeah, worth checking out. But that's it. That's where we're going to wrap the video. Thanks for watching. Smash that like button. Let's go.